Shoots and Ladders. I love that game. I did too. <laughs> it's a children's game that we've been playing with our weather this summer. Up and then back down. Certainly. Well, this month of July has been sliding more often than not. So Storm Team 10's Joseph Dames take a look, takes a look at some of the cool sweatshirt numbers we've seen. More often than not, when we see numbers like this right here, they don't always seem accurate. 70s in the summer? Well, they are, and we've seen that just about all July. Here's our roller coaster of a ride of July. Daytime highs only reaching 71 degrees at times to just a whopping July high temperature of 88 degrees on the 22nd. If we do a little math, our average so far this month has been 81 degrees, nearly 7 to 8 degrees below our 30-year average. Here is a look at the next 6 to 10 days from the Climate Prediction Center. Well below average probability for us across the region, but for the month of August, it looks like it could go either way. I'd say there is nothing better than the 90s. Well, those who grew up in the 70s and 80s might argue that, but we might be able to agree that the cooler summer has been refreshing. In Terre Haute with Chief Photojournalist Mike Latta, I'm Joseph Dames, Storm Team 10. That negative 12 doesn't look very refreshing. <laughs> we can't forget about precipitation as well. As of right now, we are sitting above our yearly average at about one and a half inches.